Everyone can use a review on nitroglycerin use in the emergency setting. So if you have chest discomfort, heaviness, pressure, squeezing, radiating to the jaw, back, down the arms, first thing you wanna do is either sit down or lie down. The reason for this is that this medication can lower your blood pressure quite drastically. And the last thing you wanna do is fall over and hit your head and cause another problem. So you wanna take the spray out. If you haven't used it for a few weeks or so, you wanna do something called priming. Priming is where you take the canister and you squeeze it away from you, away from anybody else, any open flames, and just give it about five to eight squeezes until you see the medication come out. And then what you wanna do is bring it up to your mouth, lift up your tongue if you can, and one spray under the tongue. Or if you can't for whatever reason, in the side of the cheek should be okay as well. Don't swallow, don't spit, don't eat anything, don't rinse your mouth for the next five to 10 minutes after the dose. The reason for that is because you have blood vessels underneath your tongue that actually helps to absorb the medication faster and get it to your system and where you need it to go faster than if you were to swallow it. If after you use one spray and you feel like you need that second spray, this is time you wanna take your phone out. Depending on how significant your chest discomfort is, you may wanna call 911 right away. This is really a judgment call on your part, but you should get some guidance from your doctor depending on how significant your disease is. So the maximum you should take is three doses within 15 minutes. If by then you have not contacted anyone, you should call 911 immediately. Some people may use this medication in advance prior to any vigorous activity or sexual intercourse. And we usually advise people to use about five to 10 minutes before exercise if you need it. And say after you feel a little bit better and you need to get up, make sure you're getting up nice and slow so you don't accidentally make yourself lightheaded and dizzy because some of the medications still may be lingering in your body. The most common side effects are things like headache, this is actually kind of a good sign because it suggests that you are absorbing the medication and it should be working. Some people may get flushing, numbness, tingling, those types of sensations, particularly in their hands and fingers. If you have a racing heart that won't go away, any rashes that develops, unusual swelling, itchiness, or difficulty breathing, these are signs that you need to seek medical attention earlier than later. If by chance you are taking a medication called either Cialis, Viagra, or Levitra, these are medications typically used for erectile dysfunction, make sure you are not using this nitroglycerin within 24 or 48 hours from that dose, depending on which agent it is. And you should speak to your pharmacist about that. If by chance you don't have access to the nitroglycerin spray, but you have the nitroglycerin tablets instead, the same rules typically apply. You park it under your tongue and don't swallow for five to 10 minutes and just wait for that tablet to kind of dissolve after the initial five minutes. If the discomfort is still there, you might want to give yourself that second dose. Call 911 if you need. Maximum dose again is three. Do not store this medication either in the car, in the bathroom, where there's any fluctuation in temperature and humidity because that can affect the stability of the medication. Last but not least, I always remind people that the people around them should know how to do high quality CPR. Because if you have heart artery disease, chances of you having a dangerous heart rhythm in the event of a heart attack can be quite high and is life-threatening. Make sure you and your loved ones know how to do that. Hi, I'm Herb, the heart pharmacist, if you're new to this channel, and I go over heart medications to help you choose and use wisely. Say no to drugs.